Hey everybody, Metal Gamer Geek here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Dungeons of Hinterburg. And we left off, we did the first two dungeons. There's 25 of these things in the game. Uh, I geared up a little bit. Um, photo mode we unlocked. Oh. Oops. Move up, move down. How do I get out of this? Adios. I have to go talk to that one lady. So that was, we got the skill shrine. We did the abandoned mine shaft. She could have tell us where to go and what to do. Dungeons? Seven dungeons in total in this area. One of them houses the main monster around here. That's on Dober Kogel Summit. Won't you unless you've made it through the other dungeons in this area. So that's like boss mode. Uh, look for a labyrinth of mountain pines near the top. It leads to two more. One is past some really tough monsters just a little up the trail. Okay. In the middle of a lake. Well, since I see the sign for the lake. I think I'm going to go for that one. The lake. And that's right, shift isn't run. <laughs> Hello, monsters. Dodge. Dodge. Is that a perfect parry or perfect dodge or whatever? Oh, so if I dodge at the right moment, it does something different. Jelly tunnels, the minecart workshop. Damn it. But did I see things down here? What is this? It's like a perfect spot to rest for an afternoon and just enjoy the scenery. Stay here and not do a dungeon today. It'd probably increase my relaxation and down there could increase my health. Oh. Uh, yeah, why not? Peaceful up here. Should have done this a long time ago. Don't worry, I have to be nobody who needs anything, nothing of consequence going on. Just me somewhere in the middle of the mountains watching the afternoon go by. It's so much lighter up here. Like the parts of me that were are never satisfied with myself have just gone quiet for a while and I could be free. Just spend a few hours taking in the view doing absolutely nothing. I want that. Day three evening. So can you can only do engineering in the afternoon. Very special eye, these stones are superior as an Australian night sky. Thank you for them, dearly dearly. Pleasure, love. Oh, this was the date. This is the friend you were talking about? You should meet Hannah. She runs a boutique smithy down by the tourist info. Mostly a magic workshop these days. Let me see your hands. Here. Magic went deeps in your heart lines. You have a strong will. Good for you. Some aloe should help with the chafing. Dungeons are rough places. So you got a slot open? Teach her the basics? Each me? Yeah, tonight. It must be tonight. Tomorrow is Mum's birthday, and I've got a group of Korean tourists on Friday. I'm down by the lake, I'll mark the location on your map, so she's there. That's an easy one to get to, considering I have that. New quest, hello, Hannah. Basics of what? You'll see, you're gonna like it. 
Hen is usually booked out. Nice of her to make an exception. Head down to the tourist lake next to the tourist info. We'll keep her waiting, yeah? You can thank me later. Well then. Fast travel. And here we are. Spellbound Smithy. Good. Should we get started? I take all evening. If I want to do any shopping, I should. I don't have money, so I don't have a clue what this is about. You will in a moment. Come. So is this an actual smithy? There are three realms that touch when slaying: the magical monsters and spells, human element, the slayer, and her ferocious spirit. Physical, broad swords, armor, cold matter. Magic, human, physical. People think of these domains in one way connections. The slayer uses a sword, the sword strikes the monster. Our work is about the bigger picture and the smaller. Here, hold this. Bleed tornado. Rock. Quartz. But the material is unimportant. What's important is that you hold it and focus. In slots for attack conduits, attack conduits can be used in combat. Oh, I saw this. So there's slots on your weapon. Been across the battlefield hitting everything in your path. Oh, one, see, one day a beam of sunlight refracted through the mo a monster's skin in just the right way. It touched this little trinket here. Imbuing the physical, the magical flavor. Now a slayer become, comes along, adds the human element, adds a little bit of their own magic, and presto! Focus. Hold down the attack conduit button and press button for the respective slot. Attack conduits cool down after they're triggered to so use them wisely. Uh, so what is the attack conduit? Oh! Oh my, that is a tornado of pain. So, you know, I call these trinkets attack conduits. Happy little accidents, aren't they? They channel mental energy into powerful spells. Try this one next. Yes, it's an old candy wrapper. A kobold king used to wear it like a brooch. Where it is very shiny. Destructive leap. Like the second slot, destructive. Do I get the option to like swap out my abilities? Oh yeah! Beautiful! You'll find that it takes a lot of folks to trigger an attack conduit. Allow yourself some time to recharge. The capacity for channeling them will grow over time. These two conduits are yours to keep as a token of our bond. Come again in a couple of days, will you? There's more I can show you. Yeah, we're acquaintances! Nice. So, that answers my question from earlier. Morning is like interaction with a person. Afternoon is dungeon dungeoneering. Evening is develop a friendship with somebody and shop. And night is this. Leveled up them guys. So is that a permanent HP buff? Go to bed, but like there was other stuff to do in here, right? Player's Guide to Hinterberg. I wouldn't mind staying up a little longer and reading. I just arrived here. I really don't want to be tired tomorrow. Like, what's the point of showing me these things that I can't do, huh? Maybe later in the uh, story I get to do them. Maybe. Now we're going to go back to that cafe in the front. Good morning. Did the Frau lines sleep well? Like a groundhog. I do hope you have an appetite like one as well. I hear the repairs in Hinterworld are going well. They say public access to the area should be restored by tomorrow. It's just in time for the Onion Festival. That's going to be the day after. Mark it on your calendars. Onion Festival? What else would it be? I wonder if they'll finally reveal the new fountain on the main square. 
I don't think sure needed a fresh coat of paint. I'll leave it to your breakfast. I'm sure you two have a long day of slaying planned out. Well, there's so there's special of I wonder if I need to finish everything up within a certain amount of time because I think she said something about being here for two weeks my character they're almost done with the repairs in Hinterwald Hinterwald the Hinterworld they sure work faster on here I've seen that damage and that the earthquake did there it's nothing to laugh at what's it like it's this beautiful old forest, lovely, you know. But more importantly, you get a whole set of mad new set of magic spells there. You'll enjoy it, believe me, the monsters there can get pretty tough. Got some gear I haven't been using, thinking it might help you. The stuff I just bought. Listen, if you're the kind of slayer who searches every nook and cranny for an extra treasure chest, you might not even need all this stuff. Same thing goes if you've been to gear and more and boss. Yep, already done. If so, that's cool. Just sell the gear and buy yourself an extra potion. Oh! Then have a look at what you're carrying. If any of this could give you an edge, or to equip it. So I didn't even get a chance to use the stuff that I bought. Let's go to Obergogel. Yeah, noon. We explore. Fast forward. Um, I thought those were like actual weird things that had to fight, but they're peoples. Greetings, hero. Yes, well, welcome. Wow, it gets them every time. We are the real monsters of Hinterberg, the realist, and we have a quest for a hero such as yourself. Um, what is it? You see, we are collecting parts of our fallen brethren, or our club, for magical purposes which we shall not discuss with a creature of flesh. But we have Hinterbox hero, bucket loads of them, but also rewards. Yes, rewards. We are creatures of magic. We shall increase your powers in ways of which you have not yet dared to dream in the wildest of your dreams. If you give us the monster parts. Give us now. Silence! Yes, if you collect monster parts, bring them to us. We shall reward you very handsomely indeed. Uh, I have a bunch of those. Your first reward shall be... Tell us a hundred monster parts and we will give you a large HP potion. Uh, I have 48. Give me a lot of hinter bucks. Okay, they weren't kidding. Cool beans. Now, I gotta go back to that lake that I was supposed to go to yesterday, but... Well, the monsters aren't here this time. Monster tooth? I've noticed in the different color of items. Hinterbucks, Cobaldine, HP snack. Rather be right hanging with Marina and play games. You here is so nice. Sometimes I spend all day relaxing down by the table and I feel so refreshed afterwards. I guess I wasn't supposed to go to that just yet. Trash. I wonder if I get a like a reward for picking up all the trash. So the leak is this way. That sounds mighty large. Jelly tunnels. That's where we're trying to go, the jelly tunnels. I think. I just want to collect all of the things, please. No 
Nope, can't climb that. New dungeon discovered. Fast travel point, so I could just beam here super quick. Wait a minute, could I have just... That's the mountain lake. That's the western crossing. Oh, that's I could just legitimately teleport to these places now once I go there. Jelly tunnels. Level one. Another worldly heat emanates from this portal. Am I ready? Defense rating, attack rating. Yeah, I am good to go. I am will advance. So yeah, you get one dungeon per calendar day. Let's go. Wonder if they're procedurally generated or if they're like handcrafted. Get over here. Oh. No. Nope, that was not the way to go. Try this again. Does that mean that there were other things I could have gotten to over there? No, it doesn't look like it. Climb up this stuff. Can't do anything here. There you are. That, uh, bomb. Whoa, okay. Didn't want to do that. It's definitely the spot for bombs. Nope. Um, okay, so be super careful around those ledges. Thankfully, you don't lose HP or you don't have, like, lives. Alright, so try this again, please. Push it along, please. Hmm, maybe it's from the other side. I gotta do it. Okay. Stop jumping over the bridge. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have problems. Try this again. First try. All right, go. I guess we run and jump. Yep. What? You get summoned into an attack, it's pretty uh, jarring when that circle shows up. Monster parts, that just means money. Alright, so I'm gonna go in. Okay. 
I supposed to maybe... Pull that? That out. Try this again. Can't jump up there. There. What? Ladder. first. Oh. But there's nowhere for me to go, right? Be able to... Yes. There. And we're golden up here, I think. Uh, what is this? What is this view? How do I exit that view? Weird. I'm trying to like turn around and see things, but I can't. I jump across that thing. Oh. We're down here for good now. Okay. Okay, what's this thing? A waystone? Uh, when re-entering an incomplete dungeon, you can continue from the last waystone. Oh, okay. You can also save the game manually, even though you're in a dungeon. Or you could leave. Let's save it, just says we did it. Uh Oh Spooters get out of here Spiders poison you, okay Don't you dare. Oh, not these little guys again. I got a tab or a middle mouse button to lock on. That makes things a little bit easier. Okay, so fight completed. Don't run too fast. Okay, that just does that. Hmm.
There's a chest down here. Oh, there is someone. Uh, one of the friends I can make knows how to unlock chests. So now, how does this work? Not like that. Okay. Let's see something here. This lined up like so. Get this lined up like so. And then we start the party. Yes. Guessing we do this again. Give me those things. Um, maybe? Oh. So, is there a way to do this from up here? Yeah. I understand. That's going to spin that way. It already missed. going, please. That should do it. Yep. Just gotta hop on this jelly thing. And that's the exit. Mom doesn't break that stuff, right? No. Oh. Right there. Physical magic attack boost. What did I just get? Was that a charm? Yeah. Dungeon completed. We did the jelly tunnels before we got to the giant cavern. Okay. Why does it seem like something weird is that? Oh, just letting you know, hey, you can leave now. Wow. Oh. Wow. Yeah. She smashes her hand through that gel wall with authority. Evening time. So I need to figure out who gives me the ability to open chests. How was adventuring today? Slamming big? Get the hang of it. We should go sparring sometime. See if you can teach me a thing or two. Good to see you loosening up, Louisa. Seriously. 
I'm glad I stayed. Thanks for talking me into it. What made you so hell-bent on getting out of Vienna in the first place? No one thing in particular. Uh, job. You know, it took me about one week of working at a law firm to figure out that I hate being a lawyer. More than that, I realize I hate that I'm that kind of person. And that had her whole life planned out, always thinking it'd just take a few tough years to get to the good parts. Finding your path. My entire life, I, it always felt clear what the smart next thing to do was, or what steps would lead there. If there's always a next step that's not too far off to reach, you don't think that much about whether or not you're even on the right path. You don't risk taking an unknown turn. You're constantly tired from just moving straight ahead. Flatmate. And then there's my flatmate, Carol, one of my oldest friends. Glamorous, glitzy Carol, always leaving her dishes in the sink. She recently started hinting that it's time I got my own place so her boyfriend can move in. I'm the one who looked at a dozen flats before I found the place. Uh, time flying by. I feel like I've kept delaying every liberty... I feel like I've kept delaying every liberty other people take in their 20s to focus on getting ahead. And now my friends are starting to settle down and I've just been going nowhere. When I was a kid, something as simple as exploring a forest was a magical experience. I feel like I just stopped having new experiences, like everything I do, every connection I make just feels like more of the same routine. Yeah, let me just trauma dump a little bit. How about you? Who are you, who are you where, when you're not fighting mythical creatures? You know what? Who cares? We're here. Mm, I don't like that. I don't like that. I just dumped everything and you're just gonna be like, yeah, let's not talk about me. We're here now. We get to decide who we are. Sure. Right now I'm a person on holiday. Yeah, I should get to know the person. We can get along. See, this place gives us a chance to do extraordinary things every single day. Want to get out of your rut? This is your chance. Go tune into the weirdness around you. Go out tonight and make a new friend. Live a different life for a while. It's what vacations are for. Talk soon, okay? So, let me consult my little book here. People. Uh, help find a hidden dungeon. No, we want to find... The one who can... Open locked treasure chest. Have never met. Okay. We find a Thea. That's what we gotta do. We gotta, like, talk to. What's around here? Gertrude? Hannah, Marina, Klaus, Renaud, Albert, Jay, Sam, Guy, Travis. I don't see that lady. Kai. Additional attack conduit slot. I didn't even use that thing, so I'm not even going to try to their friend just yet. Renaud, Renown. Renaud. Combo counter. That could be fun. Go we'll talk to that man's. This way. It's probably down there. Or right here. Oh. Most renowned in town. I've seen this guy around. Maybe I could strike up a conversation. Nice view from up here. Looking for anything in particular? Serenity. With that, he becomes still as ice again. It's clear this guy won't talk to me. At least not until I get some renown around here. I have to do more dungeons first. Renown you get from doing dungeons. Let's go talk to maybe the dude who we encountered. At... Can I just talk to you and not pass time? I guess not. Campfire is pretty busy tonight. It sounds like they're discussing whether to take time to explore every corner of a dungeon. 
Shops are gonna close soon. Do I have everything I need for tomorrow? Uh, we'll slightly deepen my relationships with everyone there. We'll also slightly increase my renown. We'll like, ooh, that's actually pretty neat. I have 4,700 bucks. Hinter bucks. But I need to sell you some duplicate armor. Uh, sell that. Resonant leggings. How about we try to buy some stuff now? The current physical attack is 11. Magical attack is 8. This will bring my crit rate and crit damage up. So this is more for like heavy hitters. This is more for like combo people. And this is more for all around. No perks over here. But you get more slots to customize the weapon. And swords? No, I want to maybe go back to the armor spot because I'm wearing tank stuff. Maybe I'll be in everybody. Fence. What I'm currently wearing, so I think maybe I'll just go with one of these. Let's equip it. Equip it good. All right, so now let's go back to that campfire. That's going to get me three people. Acquainted with... Or it's going to get me acquainted with the main dude, and it's going to introduce me to the other two people. Yeah. I'm not knocking it. You do you. I'm saying I'm not the kind who's going to spend all day in a dungeon. In and out in under an hour usually got a busy schedule look you're good joe or jay you know it i know it but i've been at this game for a while too if you don't stop for loot at some point you just hit a brick wall some of those dungeons are hard plus it's a nice feeling you know finding a secret pathway getting something shiny how about you breeze through the dungeons or stop and search every nook and cranny f and f All right, some people have an eye for finding secrets. I'm not the type. Come on, it's not hard. Professor, a little help. Oh yes, bringing a team of grad students with you can work wonders. Heh. <laughs> In lieu of that, 180 degree turns are often surprisingly effective as well. <laughs> what do you mean? Most people don't think to turn around and see what's behind them. If you enter a room, look around, particularly to where you came from. Yep, look up too. Climbing is your friend, you know? I wouldn't call it my friend, but I concur with the statement. Look for paths in unexpected places. Anything you could walk on could be a, could be worth a closer look. I like how they sprinkle little bits of tips and wisdom here instead of like trying to speed read it on a thing right here. I'll never be able to do. Now it's nighttime. Time to go back to my home. It's been a long day. So now I have a bunch of that. Let's go. Do the dungeon so I get more HP. I got a bunch of monies. Build some things. Let's go to bed. One of these days I'm gonna enjoy my my flat, my little room, and read a book or watch TV or something. Reese is definitely a morning person, but she's more chipper than usual today. Good morning, Fraulein. Tomorrow is the night of the Onion Festival. Isn't that exciting? I wonder who will be our Onion Queen this year. Can anyone become an Onion Queen? If you're looking to put yourself up, I'm afraid the competition will be fierce. Oh, I almost forgot. Did you hear they restored public transport to the Hinterwald area? Runnel Sumpf and... Oh, I'm so bad at reading these kind of things. <laughs> 
Brunelsumpf and Kolmstein are still off limits, I'm afraid. That earthquake must have really done a number there. But still, so many new dungeons to explore. Have you thought about where you're going today? I'm gonna keep working the place that I know about, Doberkugel. Because also, there's more for me to do here. Well, there's only one for me to do, the giant cavern, and then this one's the ancient tree. So let's go to the giant cavern if we can. Gotta try to find that cavern. Dungeons themselves aren't all that tricky so far. I feel like once I get to those more difficult ones, yes, it'll change completely. Fast forward. So, we've been here. I don't think I've been up there yet, though. Can I set a waypoint? I can. So let's go talk to my monster club. Pick up monster club friends. I got you some parts. What is that? I'm able to find my fourth dungeon today. Um, that's kind of where I'm looking to go. Is that my waypoint? Am I just a fool? Yeah, you're a fool. <laughs> Stop with the thing. I'm pushing space shift to, to run. Oh, look, the cows are gone now. This area. Cows have moved ever so slightly. But this isn't the way that I was looking to go, is it? No. We can still check this out. Yeah, that's a little too rough for me. But we can go down here. How about we go to the portal, get the waypoint, so that later I don't... Well, I also may run into level 7 monsters, right? Let's just see what's over the bridge. Yeah, I feel like maybe there's a skill I have to unlock to get across to there. I would have loved to get over that plateau, but I fear that's not possible right now. Yeah. I have to unlock something that lets me get there. Okay, worth a try, but also I got more stuff. What are these magic elements that I'm picking up? Question. Well. I want to get to that house. I want to go to there. Oh, hello. Fight! Whoa. You guys ain't playing around, are you? Okay. Yeah, if you leave it on target, that's nuts. Okay. I see some stuff around here. Cyclable trash. So there's different levels of trash in the game. I like it. Honey? Looks like a perfect spot to rest for an afternoon and just enjoy the scenery. Nope. Gonna increase my health? No, we are in this to get to, uh, what do you call it? We want to try to find this cavern, right? Western Crossing, maybe? That have options? 
Mine cart workshop. I mean, it's a little bit stronger than me, but like not the most terrible thing, I think. Attack. Holy heck. Okay, I could have I should have sh saved it for this stuff here. Now I understand why this is a highly rated area, huh? trouble here. Oh, uh, boo, thank you. I think we're just about done with this fight, I hope. She is not my favorite. That was a heck of a fight. Holy butts. Okay. Uh, I think I'm under leveled for this area. I guess I was supposed to go to Hinterwald, right? Hinterwald? I want to see what's over here now. Western Mine Entrance. Okay. That conduit, Ravenous Hunger? Immediately destroy all enemy shields and gain mana from them. Following 10 seconds, consume all enemy projectiles and recharge. Ooh, that's neat. Okay. Oh, this isn't the way. If I try doing this, it's going to be like, yeah, you're only a level two, buddy. Stay here. Well, I guess my quest is telling me to go to the Hinterwald. Hinterwald? I keep saying it like that. Um, yeah, so I, I finished this. Finished this. Yeah, I should do that scenic spot, I guess, right? Where's that scenic spot exactly? Let's put a little... This one. This way. That's the, that's the bench. I want the one with the table, I guess. It's this guy, right? The shed. And let's, let's take this stuff here. Go hang out at the Onion Festival, I guess, right?
Insects are buzzing in the grass, the trees swaying in the breeze. It's a perfect summer afternoon, a little time off, a little rest, just what I need. Would I be able to revisit these spots to get these things? I always feel like my time is only worth something if it results in tangible progress. Almost more work for me just to let loose. And you're tightly wound. I know the feeling. That's why I'm here, to work on being a little less hardworking. And I'm finally getting better at it. Good. Deserve. Evening. So now we gotta go to the Onion Festival? Boots Verleith. It's a dock? Welcome Slayer. This is different. So... Anna, Julian, Alex, Danny, Travis. What's the David? Bea. It was something about being down by the trading spot, right? A uh, log. Anything about? Picture of a dungeon. Oops. I have to deliver 100 monster parts and then another 200. So it's not like total. Okay. I don't think I have. I think it'd be great to get MP increase, but I want to know what they were. Where's this? Uh. Onion festivals at. Oh, this is another spot? I didn't have that one? Boat rental? Oh, yeah, they were talking about this stuff. The square with uh, the reveal of the new statue. Boat rental. Myself this evening, nobody said I have to be social all the time. Would your relax relaxation increase your magical and physical attack? I am a bit of a loner. I want to see what's up with this thing here. That's the dude about. Young lady from the other day. Never thank you for your help at the skill shrine. These apricot ice dumplings here, I cannot seem to remember what the locals call them. Yeah. Ah, that's it. Let us summon one post haste. Closing down soon, you know. Uh. Oh, well, yeah. Check the rewards. You're going to give me the MP slot increase. Yes. Let's get some weird dumplings. You're some kind of wizard? Sometimes I am a comparative mythologist by training. I study the appearance of magic in the world. 25 dungeons of Hinterberg, 5 dungeons of Hastings, the Venice Anomaly. This has been growing recently. 5? So there's 30 technically? Technically? Let me tell you, these ice dumplings are certainly one of the perks of my profession. What did you find? What? Why did magic appear in Hinterberg, of, of all places? Ah, oh, the rush of youth. If I had an answer, I would, be, I would be back in Brussels, presenting it to my grad students. Tell me, is there something peculiar you have noticed about the monsters you've slain? Uh, they look like creatures from the uh, mythology. Very good, we're getting to the heart of the matter. They imitate creatures from your local mist. There is a distinction to be made here. You encounter not a perked, but a creature wearing a perked mask. Now, if the monsters of Hinterberg imitate local myths, does it not stand to reason that it was something of in your mythology that attracted magic in the first place? Maybe. Let's contemplate the, uh, the dumpling, shall we? How does one? How does that? It sure is tasty. 
You see, the basic ingredients for the dumpling are the same across cultures. You have something starchy and rich in carbohydrates, commonly flour, but perhaps the potato. You mix it with fat and liquid, take some water and oil or butter, take the milk for all I care. Perhaps you will want a, ri a raisin, so he's just talking about baking, uh, a raisin agent. Uh, perhaps it is taken care of by other ingredients. You could also replace salt with sugar if you like. Then if you stuff it and boil or steam or fried little sucker to your heart's delight. Your point being? My point is that most cultures have invented the dumpling in one form or another. And yet each of them sways a tiny bit off the beaten path. That is where the results become delightful and unique and something sometimes magical. Quite the same with mythology, would you say not? You think there's an ingredient in our mythology that attracted magic to Hinterberg? Well, what is it? Ah, you see, that is yet for me to find out. For now, I propose we shall concentrate our ice dumpling on our ice dumplings, lest they melt into gooey puddles themselves. Ice dumplings? Close my eyes and think of myself casting a spell. The alien tingling from my hands to my spine started to feel less alien. Oh, we are acquainted. Nice. Now it is night time. Been a long day. I haven't found that dungeon. Relaxation is buffed. I'm as chill as can be. I'm beat. Should go to bed. I want to check this other stuff out. I wonder if that means... If I do this, it will, um, like, make me skip the morning part, go right into the noon evening, like the noon port. Oh, ground shaking lights are flickering. Is it another earthquake? This feels different. Some feels like stomps. Players, don't panic. There's no cause for alarm. Aware from the mayor's office, our seismologists have determined there is absolutely no reason for concern. We experienced a minor aftershock from the earthquake a few days ago, back a few days back. Our dungeons will continue to operate normally. Have a magical night, everyone. Get some rest for tomorrow's adventures. Something about this town. There's a minor aftershock. By now, I've been in. Much greater danger in the dungeons. Try to shrug it off, and I'm surprised it's working. Something about this mayor's office doesn't uh, strike me as truthful. It's morning time! Another earthquake last night. Everything alright with you? First time I'm even thinking of it this morning. Yeah, I'm alright. I wasn't... I wasn't right in the middle of a dungeon this time, you know? What how all this becomes so normal after a while, huh? How long have you been here? For well, once, I really don't have to be anywhere right now, so this seemed like a good place to set up camp. You're going, you're going to the thing tonight, yeah? The Onion Festival? Oh, it's tonight! Thinking about it. I mean, it's a festival about onions. Not going to be much of an option anyway. The whole village is going to be on the main square. You and I, we should meet up and go together. Come find me tonight when you're ready. Okay. Oh, hello, Klaus. Yeah, are you two all right? Yeah. Don't worry, we're fine. So glad to hear that. I was really worried about you, Louisa, after what you went through. Listen, they restored access to Kolmstein Glacier this morning. Word of caution, some of the dungeons there are advanced. I hear they have some new gear down at the gear and more. Might be a good idea to go shopping this evening and go up to Colmstein tomorrow. When you go up there, don't forget the pager I gave you. If you ever feel like you've hit your limit, use it. I'll have someone get you out of the dungeon immediately. If you're ever free in the evening, stop by the tourist info. I'd love to chat with you. Hmm. Uh. Holmes, you know, I hope you packed warm underwear. 
All right, so I can't find this giant cavern yet. This has the ancient tree, and Colmstein has terrible, terrible, terrible starts for me. All right, so I guess we'll just travel to Hinterwald and try to find this level two place. It is the noontime. Unlock the thing. Reach the skill shrine. Oh, what's this? I could I could just walk snacks. Talk to the local kid just sitting on a bench. Already completed a dungeon today. I'm taking the bus back to Hinterberg to enjoy some celebratory schnitzel. Schnitzel is delicious. Well 180. I return to Hinterberg. Time will advance, yeah, so no matter what I do, it's going to advance the time. Um, you know what? I think this is a good spot to call it for today. Did a couple of things. Uh, quit to menu. Well, yeah, I guess we're just going to have to start up that whole collecting three items behind me again next time. Um, yeah. That's going to do it for this episode of Let's Play Dungeons of Hinterberg. Uh, if you like the video, drop a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to the channel, and ring the notification bell to get alerted when I post more content here on YouTube. Uh, leave comments, share the video, share the channel. The best way to support what I'm doing, and I really do appreciate it. But until next time, take care, have a good one, and I'll see you soon.